Liverpool interested in beta race. Liverpool have been linked with loads of top talents from Brazil over the past 18 months or so. Fluminense's André Trindade looked poised to join the Reds in summer of 2023, for example, but ultimately opted to stay in Rio de Janeiro. Things came full circle for André on Saturday, as he played for Wolves against the team he so nearly joined. But while most of those seemingly on Liverpool's radar have been midfielders and attackers, the Athletic now claim that the Reds are one of the side's tailing centre-back Vita Race. Race has burst onto the scene at Palmeiras this season, breaking into the first team and playing 14 times for the Brazilian champions so far. This has reportedly led to strong interest from a host of top European sides. Real Madrid and Arsenal appear to be pushing hardest so far, with both said to have made initial inquiries with Palmeiras over his sale. But Liverpool are said to be in there as well. The Reds, Chelsea and Barcelona are said to have expressed interest in signing the 18-year-old. Palmeiras are claimed to want to keep race until after the 2025 Club World Cup, though, and have not initially put a price tag on his potential transfer. However, the defender does reportedly have a release clause of around £83 million. Beta race could be Virgil van Dijk's long-term heir. It is encouraging to see Liverpool targeting young centre-backs right now. The Reds are in serious need of addressing the future of their back line. Should Virgil van Dijk leave next summer as looks quite likely they will need a long-term plan to replace him. While race is incredibly young, especially for a centre-back, the teenager has the potential to be special. In October 2023, the Guardian named race as one of the best 60 young players in the world. The Palmeiras youngster, Liverpool interested in Vita race. Liverpool have been linked with loads of top talents from Brazil over the past 18 months or so. Fluminense's André Trindade looked